1 Thessalonians, chapter 1, a letter written by Paul, Silas, and Timothy to the church in Thessalonica, is a profound piece of scripture that speaks volumes about faith, love, and hope in the face of trials. As we delve into this passage, we understand the depth and sincerity of their message, which resonates strongly with believers today. The opening verses of this chapter set the tone of gratitude and joy. Paul commends the Thessalonians for their work produced by faith, labor prompted by love, and endurance inspired by hope in our Lord Jesus Christ. This isn't just a polite greeting. It's a powerful acknowledgement of the genuine faith and vibrant community life that marked the believers in Thessalonica. Their faith was active, their love was laborious, and their hope was steadfast, even in the midst of severe suffering. This text challenges us to examine our own lives. Are our actions reflective of a faith that actively engages with the world? Does our love for others push us to labor, to work tirelessly for the benefit of our community and those in need? And in the face of trials, does our hope in Christ propel us forward, giving us the endurance to overcome? Paul also mentions the Thessalonians' reception of the word in much affliction with joy of the Holy Spirit. This juxtaposition of affliction and joy is striking. It's a reminder that the Christian journey isn't one devoid of challenges. In fact, the path often includes trials and difficulties. However, the presence of the Holy Spirit brings a joy that transcends these challenges. It's a joy not rooted in external circumstances, but in the unshakable reality of God's love and salvation. Moreover, the believers in Thessalonica became a model to all the believers in Macedonia and Achaia. Their faith in God had become known everywhere. Thus, they were an example of how the transformative power of the gospel radiates outward from a community of believers. This prompts us to consider how our faith is witnessed by those around us. Are we living in such a way that others can see the change that Christ has made in our lives? The closing verses of this chapter point to their conversion from idols to serve the living and true God and to wait for His Son from heaven. This is a vivid portrayal of the Christian life, turning away from the empty promises of the world and serving God wholeheartedly while waiting for the return of Christ. This waiting isn't passive. It's an active, vigilant, and hopeful anticipation that shapes how we live each day. 1 Thessalonians chapter 1 is a call to a living, active faith. It challenges us to examine our faith, our love, our hope, and our witness. This passage doesn't just comfort, it confronts. It doesn't just encourage, it exhorts. It's a powerful reminder that our journey of faith is one of continuous growth, unwavering love, and enduring hope in the face of life's trials and tribulations.